Hello and welcome to Let's Play Super Mario 3D Land. I have, damn it, wrong file. No. <laughs> um. Whoops. Okay, I'll just soft reset. That was my. F well, not really my first file. It's like my fifth file. <laughs> that's technically my third file. I basically have like save points, but that's my complete file that I accidentally went to. It's like all complete, so yeah, whatever. Let's continue playing with Mario, who I care less about. Luigi's where it's at. All right, so we got place that doesn't want to focus quickly. We got booze. Yay, booze! Don't you love them? We got coins. Yeah, that's for coins. You could slap booze, but they'll just come right back. So in this version, actually, there hasn't really been many boos in 3D games, but I mean, yeah, there has since. Whoops. And these are some new ghost enemies. They basically replace boos in some of their functions. But yeah. And save point. I'm trying to adjust this. Hmm. So if we go here, booze everywhere. And invincibility! And that spawned more booze if you went into it. Yep, that's the only way you can really kill booze. Everything else just stuns them. Actually, yeah, even stunned to anything. I don't think this does anything. Oh, it does. <laughs> I didn't notice that. That was pure chance. Um, over here. We get a cardboard pipe, which is an actual pipe. I think I was trying to say something about booze. Oh yeah, they're basically like their 2D games. And they could pretty much only go from... Like, they can't move vertically. That's, they can only move horizontally. Or whatever plane it is. That they move in. Kind of like sting buys, which follow you. And you have to face them in their general direction for them to hide. Yeah, well, you're supposed to walk here and it's supposed to appear at the last second. And now we've got an invisible maze. Which you're supposed to approach, but really, it's not that hard. And it's supposed to be you chasing your boat. And tricked. And there should be something here. You must die! So yes, Big Boo makes a return and does usually what a Big Boo does. Come at the last second and then kill your ass. Well, not really. But that, that has been prominent in most games, actually. I remember one Super Princess Peach. We had to bring it to the light and use that as a platform. That was pretty odd if you ask me. Stupid light. <laughs> but yeah. Now we've never got this ghost house down. Yeah. Is this the first ghost house? I don't remember. It's nice it's nice that ghost houses are back. They were a bitch. <laughs> Actually ghost houses were never in 3D games, so well they're sort of, but not really. Screw you. See, there's some more sting buys here. And this is really... Just to add the ding. The other, I don't get it. What's with some of those things? Like, what's the point? It's like they have them there, but... Nope. Nope. And let's go in here. What's in here? Everything's an invisible coin block. There was something there. But I do. Okay. So, this is basically those flip switch things. Whoops. Yeah, that was kind of close. Nice. And these don't have anything to do there, don't they? Of course. 
And we're back here. If I recall, I think there was a... Like, a harder level version of this in the special world and... Or... Yeah, I don't remember anything. I'm stupid. Never mind. This part is actually pretty annoying. If you don't have Tanuki. I already have Tanuki. Okay, and there's this block, and what you're supposed to do is supposed to avoid this. Yeah, see, that's really hard without Tanuki. And now there's three past day. It's basically to get these clocks. You have to go this way. Yep. And that's all Star Coins. <laughs> so, the thing about... Yeah. I don't... What was I trying to say? Wow, I'm blinking out because I'm a moron. But anyways... How many times have I called myself a moron? Oh shit, wall jumping! Oh my god. Some new techniques here, wow. <laughs> but yeah. This is Flip Switch Galaxy. Yeah. <laughs> Flip Switch Galaxy is a completely different thing. And actually, yeah, this is a lot like Mario Galaxy when it comes to most levels. They're just like a gimmick, kind of like these things, which are switches that you hit and they create platforms. That's a lot like Mario Galaxy. These aren't levels, these are galaxies, for crying out loud. Alright, we got the airship. Say Bowser's um fuck it generator. <laughs> yeah. He generates fucks with it. And it's an airship level. Oh and hey, it's based on this gimmick. Come out here you fucking Yeah. F -f 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 fuck. One sec while I find a way to get a Tanuki back. <laughs> nope. nope. Yep. Are you gonna give me a Tanuki? Please! <laughs> Please, I beg of you. I never went in here. Oh wow, look at that. Hit detection. Yay. And now I'm gonna do this to you. You spin me right round, baby, right round. Yes. Open. I love that. Whoa. That's just incredibly silly. Oh shoot, one sec, I have a problem. Do 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 do. Okay, get the idea menu screen. Okay, welcome back. After, it took me a while, cause I had to rewind the cassette in the camera. Because this camera is old as fuck. <laughs> Oops. Sometimes I have no depth perception. Even in the game, based on depth perception. Actually, it's supposed to be based on fucking with your depth perception. Which I have none of. There was something here, yeah. Oh, right, is this? Oh, you fucker. Shit. I remember having a lot of trouble with this airship. <laughs> it took me forever to get it right. 
Yeah, I remember doing this so many times. It was a bitch. It was a bitch. Okay, got my got my Tanuki leaf back. I think there was also a special world version of this. Yeah, I remember speed running this so many times. No. Mm. Why why is it so hard to do that stupid flip jump? God. The one where you Move side to side very quickly, and then you jump. That one. Arr, I was able to get it while jumping onto the red platform. But I don't know how to do that effectively. Jeez, momentum. I can't press it. Yeah, I'm trying to do that. That reminds me, I'm so used to... I'm just gonna stay on this platform. Okay, so... <laughs> That was pretty tense. Yeah, just something down here. It's a one-up. Actually, if you fall there, you won't die. I think in one of these kind of ships, there's like a one-up right there. It's hidden. And now we're gonna face, did we face it before? We're gonna face Pom Pom, which is a female version of Boom Boom. I'm not sure if she's easier or harder. I'd say she's easier. Because you could easily just... Just do that. She's supposed to jump after doing those attacks, but... Yeah. She, her only real weapon is using her boomerang. She doesn't move much except for... That jump. Yeah, I whacked her with my tail. Got that bitch! I whacked you with my tail! Just like that toad. Boom, 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 boom. And now we got the the victory, victory airship. Do you know what? That, that reminds me. I wonder if the victory airship, like this airship that you go to after defeating a boss, I call it the victory airship. But um, it reminds me of that one airship, which is like rare as hell in Super Mario Bros. Three. Which you get from some convoluted, weird thing. And what it is, is an airship that has a bunch of coins everywhere. I think this might be, like, referencing that. The ship at the end. That, that's actually pretty interesting if they did. Because why would they remember such a thing? Okay, on to world five. First, cutscene. Anyone else find that background really trippy? I mean, just think about it. What what makes that? What, why is it all 8-bit? Oh shit, it's Super Princess Peach! Or Super Princess Peach 3D Land! They should make that. <laughs> the Monty Bulls are like, We're gonna get you! Oh man, we missed him. <laughs> he just jumped in front of us. Next time, we're gonna take on World 5, which is sort of a desert world. So you can see, we got this thing it's probably the entire level it's showing the entire level for you guys it's just smaller than what it looks like actually there's a part inside so see you next time i actually quite like this level that we're about to do